hello friends the next question regarding linked list is quite interesting one and you will surely learn a lot from it so what is the question the question is how to delete the whole linked list so how to delete complete linked list so this is very interesting problem so let's first try to again do it using what a uh, pictorial diagram so let's make a small link linked list say 3 7 8 15 so i have a linked list of length 4 here and now i want to delete the complete linked list okay so what will i do now so again for it's again a kind of traversal we have to, to delete the linked list but again we have to remember that the links are very important okay so let's see so i make so this is head and let's make a temp okay so the first question is okay so is one temp and a one temporary pointer is it enough if i do now let's say free temp then what will happen this complete pointer will be freed and i will have link to no other nodes in the link list and so i cannot delete them so one thing is very sure that somehow if you try to delete this one so if i have this i remove this free this one then this pointer will be also gone and i don't have access now temp was pointing head was pointing to the start i freed the temp and there's nothing left all these will remain intact in the memory and there will be no one to we have no access to it because we don't have any link to these nodes so it's very important here to understand that one variable won't work whenever we delete something we should have the pointer to the next element so let's try to make it much cleaner again 3 so i have made the five here so that's fine so again a 10 and a 15 okay so now i have a head here the next is i need two variables one to the first one and one to the just the next one of that so i define temp one here and i also define uh temp 2 so now what is good about this one is if i do now a free temp 1 this will be removed but i still have the pointer to the next one so now what again if i want to now do a free temp 2 so now again we cannot do that because i don't have the pointer to the next element and i if do free temp 2 everything will be gone i don't have any pointer to the next element so what will i do uh, in between these two so what i need to do is i need to say that temp 1 should be now so made equal to something like i need the next pointer so say temp to next okay so somehow what i want to say is i need two pointers one to the node i want to free and after that pointer to the node 
to the next of the node that is freed so that I can free them all ok so let's see now how to code this thing so if I move so now we see the code here so I have void delete list I have struct node star star head because now I am changing the pointers itself so I need reference to the pointer struct node start temp1 is equal to star head so if I take a small example here also so it will be 1 2 and 3 ok so if this is our example and now what happens is so my temp so this is head and this is also the temp1 struct node start temp2 also I have defined but I have not initialized it so while temp1 is not equal to null so temp1 is not null so I need to traverse again so that is good enough so temp2 now becomes what temp1 is not equal to null so I need to access to the next element so here what I do temp2 is equal to temp1 next so temp1 next is this one so now what I do I'm now because I have the pointer to the next element I can do a free temp1 so that is fine now but again so this is gone now and I have this one which is temp2 so what I need to do now so temp1 is now dangling because it's free so I now make temp1 is equal to temp2 so now what happens is temp1 is also now pointing to temp2 and again it goes to the loop temp1 is not equal to null so temp1 is not null and what I need to do now again because now both the pointers are pointing to the same node I make temp2 is equal to temp1 next so this now points temp this is removed and temp2 goes to the next element so now temp2 is pointing to node 3 so now because I have the access to the next element so what I do pre temp1 so this is gone and now I have what so temp1 is freed so I make temp1 is equal to temp2 so temp1 is also now pointing here temp2 is also now pointing here so while temp1 is not equal to null so what I do temp2 is equal to temp1 next so temp2 is now become equal to temp1 next which is null so let's draw it clearly temp2 now it goes and it becomes null ok and I do free temp1 so this is also gone and temp1 is equal to temp2 so temp2 is this one and temp1 also now becomes equal to this one so this is the way we delete a list and now finally what I do head now everything is changed nothing is pointed to by head here everything is freed so I do star head is equal to null which means what it is now empty list ok so this is a very good question and it is quite asked in the interview programming interview so I hope you understand this concept and if you like this video please subscribe to my channel please 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 and also share it in your internet thanks a lot